Uber, Lyft, and other rideshare companies determine how they handle an auto accident claim based on three scenarios. The first scenario is when an accident occurs when an Uber driver's Uber app is on where he or she doesn't have a passenger in his vehicle. And basically, they're just waiting for a ride request. Under this scenario, Uber generally will not accept liability for the accident, so you'll be forced to file a claim against the Uber driver's personal insurance policy. This can be a problem because some personal insurance policies do not provide coverage for Uber-related accidents. The second scenario is when an accident occurs while an Uber driver is en route to pick up a passenger. An accident caused under this scenario can be very tricky because it can be very, very hard to determine if an Uber driver was actually on his or her way to pick up a passenger when an accident occurred. Therefore, Uber may not accept liability under this scenario. The third scenario is when the Uber driver causes an accident while a passenger is in his or her vehicle. If an accident occurs under this scenario, Uber will generally accept liability for the claim. As you can see, Dealing with Uber after an accident can be very tricky, but don't worry. The attorneys at Council and Associates have handled numerous claims against Uber, Lyft, and other rideshare companies. So contact us immediately so we can help you too. I'm LaShonda Council Rogers with Council and Associates. We are dedicated to helping you achieve the best outcome possible at trial or through settlement. For a free confidential consultation or case review, Contact us because we fight for our clients because our firm cares.